Alright, this is just going to be a short informational video about how to remux video files. Um, the reason I'm making this video is because some people mentioned that um, files from the Seago 2 camera seem to open fine in GoPro Studio. Here's something I saw with my Seago 2 Chroma drone. Um, opens fine, you can scroll through it and things like that. Um, if I take a file that somebody gave me online that um, was shot with the Seago 3 camera and I drag and drop it into GoPro Studio, nothing happens. It just, it, it's like it doesn't know what to do with it. So the fix for that is you go in and you go into it with AVI Demux. I'm opening up AVI Demux and I'm dragging, dr dropping the file into AVI Demux. AVI Demux comes already configured. Um, you just want to copy the, your video output. You don't want to re-encode it. You just need to copy it. Same with the audio. And the only thing I'm going to change is I'm going to set this up to use the MP4 V2 Muxer. Then I'm just going to go and save. I will give it a name like test.mp4. Everything's going to happen very quickly because it's not actually re-encoding anything. It's just remuxing it. As you can see, the file is the same size. There's really no difference between the file other than that it's probably fixed the wrapper or whatever problem this wrapper had. It fixed it or whatever non-standard feature it was using. And now I can drag and drop it into here. I can scroll through it just fine. Everything seems to be in order. Um, I can play it back in GoPro Studio fine. So hopefully that's what you guys are looking for as far as how to get your Seago 3 files to load in GoPro Studio.